Hi everyone and welcome back to the Design to Live channel. Um, today I just kind of want to start off the weekend uh, with a little bit of um, reflection and um, walking you through how I am taking action on the things that I determined I needed to in yesterday's video. So you can call this accountability, if you will. So one of the reasons um, for the 30 for 30 wins challenge is to provide the tips, tools, and techniques to help you design a life that you love, but it's also to form community and have support and um, provide inspiration moments, right? And so what I'd love to do is I'd love to hear if you have had the ability to think about what those goals are and if you've done the meditation and the visualization about putting them out in your um, your future how has that been working for you thus far so um, I went ahead and I did the um, uh, I did the I watched the video and I just put my pictures out into the 30 days and um, this morning I woke up at about 7.30 and um, after um, making my bed and having my cup of coffee, I pulled out my journal and I looked at what my goals were. I decided to first go online and look at different cleaning routines and um, found one that went into daily, weekly, monthly, and annual um, type tasks. So I... Um, looked at it it looks pretty reasonable we'll see how it goes i did all of the morning um, activities and this evening um, the main evening activity is just to uh, do the dishes before i go to bed and wipe off the kitchen counter so that when i come down in the morning the kitchen is clean i already do that most of the time so that works out pretty well i started the two rooms that were giving me the sadness in my body yesterday because i thought man i don't want to have sadness in my body so <laughs> so I have a little bit of um, a, a video if you'd like to see it. It's a little bonus video that shows me um, tidying the downstairs guest room and tidying the upstairs bedroom and getting ready to um, move the furniture around. So just the process of doing that, I cleared out a big bag of garbage and um, three bags of donation stuff. and. Um, it just felt really good getting in there and taking care of the items that I'd just been um, putting off because I didn't want to allow myself to have room to feel those feelings. Well, I want you to know that um, processing your feelings, you need to make room for that, right? And, and a good way to make room is to be in action. And non-judgment right so as my feelings came up I just didn't judge them I just said okay it's I'm, I'm feeling these feelings it's okay for me to feel these feelings this is a nice safe space to be able to feel these feelings as I'm doing these um, uh, taking action on what I said that I wanted to um, as part of my goals right okay so I'm actually pretty amazed at how much easier doing the tasks has been than what I thought it was gonna be. I think I started in on doing these tasks at like 11 and it's um, uh, a little, it's like two something, 2.30ish and I've eaten lunch too um, in between this. So um, I'm actually kind of blown away at how fast this process is going. So, um, and I put all of the things that I took out of the different areas that needed to be put away, I put them away. So the only thing that I have to do is load the car up with the donation items and take them to the donations um, center. So I'm gonna do that uh, so that I don't have um, any of that hanging around still. And um, you know, I feel actually, I actually, I feel, pretty neutral. I'm not charged anymore. I don't feel a whole lot of dread or sadness. Well, with the goal exercise that we did, we really brought it um, 
to the forefront of our mind and and now we've got it set into our subconscious we're having our subconscious work for us and and bring to us our goals by taking and seeing all the opportunities to work on them right and um I, I just want to really encourage you to share what some of your goals were and what um, the outcome of that has been thus far. And I know it's only been a few days, um, but like I said, you know, in just a couple hours, I've really whipped some things into shape around here. And I'm like, oh, okay, well, maybe you guys are having the same same success. And, and that's just really a mindset shift, isn't it? Just a mindset shift. And so um, for accountability, I'd love to hear how you are doing and what your plans are for this weekend and if they um, are taking steps to move forward in the areas that you've identified. So anyway, have a lovely weekend and I will talk with you tomorrow. Bye-bye.